I'm Hal Deitch, and this is Stuart Beak. You're watching At The 10 On Air. Here's what's trending. It's Spirit Week. Monday's theme was dressed to the nines. Tuesday's was anything but a backpack. And today's is pink out. Make sure you plan for Decades Day and wear your class colors on Friday. The Varsity Quick Recall team has been preparing for upcoming matches. We visited them to see what they've been up to. Um, I'm Grace Sanders, and I actually joined the club on recommendation from Ms. Kronheinz. My sophomore year, she retired, for anyone who doesn't know her, so that's why. But she noticed I had a decent memory and was like, do you want to try this? It's basically a game of, you know, we ask the question, if you can give us the answer, give us the answer and you get a point. Um, I stuck with the club mostly because it's a lot of fun. Uh, it's for me anyway. I've always liked memory games, so it's not that abnormal to me. But it is also very stressful um, it's because you only get one answer. So there's a lot of teamwork involved. There's a lot of learning together. It's really fun when you get an answer or when someone comes out with an answer that we thought we didn't have. So if you would, you know, it's it's a big rise and fall kind of moment. Uh, so if you're looking to join an academic club, we're a small team, low stress. No one's gonna yell at you for being wrong because we've all been wrong. But it is an interesting place to be and I enjoy it very much. Thank you, Frau. We spent an afternoon with the Muslim Student Association. Let's see what they had to say. So I'm the president of the MSA at Atherton and we have club meetings every other Thursday and our club is all about creating a safe space for the Muslims and non-Muslims and also just to clear up misconceptions about Islam being that we get a lot of hate in the media. We are partnering up with the Catholic Charities of Louisville and we are collecting donations for the Afghanistan refugees who are coming to Louisville. We are collecting items like hygiene items like soap, shampoos and cleaning items like detergent and household cleaners. And our donations are, we're collecting donations until the end of October. And there's a box, which is right here, set up outside of 212B. If you need service hours, please see your club sponsor and ask them about see, uh, seeing if you can get service hours for your donations. Also, if you want to donate some money, we have a QR code that is on our Instagram, Atherton underscore MSA. And through that QR code, you can donate money through your credit card. Or if you want to donate cash, please see Ms. Bennett in 212B. We were looking for a way to give back to the community and we thought a good partnership would be to help um, Catholic Charities who helps refugees resettle in the Louisville and local area. Uh, and we partnered with them to see how a high school could help with that. And they have all kinds of needs, you know, they need furniture and they need everything to, to make and build homes. Um, but primarily we decided our best interest would be to help collect hygiene and household cleaning items right now. But we plan on staying in contact with them even though this only runs through October. We're going to stay in contact with Catholic Charities as more families come to Louisville and resettle in our area uh, to see what other needs they may have throughout the school year. So while this is our first way to help that cause, we're going to stay committed to it for this year. Up next, we have a brand new segment called Guess the Celebrity. See the questions before you ask me. No, no. See the, you'll see the answer. Time to think of it. Okay, I probably provide the answers then. Okay, so <clears throat> guess a celebrity tweet. Got it? I'm sorry. Guess a celebrity tweet. I'll say it, I'll read a tweet, and you guess a celebrity. Uh, yeah, I'm not gonna do very well with this, but go ahead. You don't know celebrities. No. Here's an easy one. Okay. I channel Will Ferrell when I'm at the Daddy Daughter dances. I have no idea. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> I got nothing. nothing at all. Nothing at all. Donda. What? Donda. Uh, I, what? He's got beef with Soldier Boy. I'm not culturally. Soldier Boy doesn't like. Him. I know the song Soldier Boy. That was a song, wasn't it? It's not a song. Soldier Boy is an artist. So, it was a song though, about ten years ago. Possibly. Yeah. Yeah. He's 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 up to speed. He's up to speed. How? It's Soldier Boy. I have to excuse my class. In a moment. Go ahead, please. I'm sorry. Okay, I'm sorry, but you failed. It's Kanye West. I, I, who? Kanye West. <laughs> I am that out of touch. My beautiful dark twisted fantasy. And I'm quite. I have. No, that's that's really strange. We're leaving. Now for some hallway headlines. The blood drive is happening on October 20th. Make sure you filled out the Google form to be able to donate blood. Thank you to everyone who's donating. Sophomores and juniors, do you have a 3.0 GPA or higher? Check out the sheet posted outside of room 205 to see if you're eligible for the National Honor Society. The French Club is meeting on October 28th and 29th to watch the French horror movie Le Diaboliques. All are welcome. The Hispanic Student Union is having their first meeting after school on the 20th in room 202B. And the Asian Student Union meets 
every first and third Friday in room 205. Thanks for watching. Be sure to tune in to At the Town on Air for all your up-to-date school news. Have a great rest of your week.